um, when I heard the alarm around one o'clock in the morning, um, I went into Andre's room to let him know that the alarm was going off and that there was possibly a fire. So at that time, we left the building, went to the main floor. Uh, we looked up along with all the other people that left the building and we saw that there was a woman on the balcony. So she was on the top floor over there. Um, she was screaming for help. So I ran back into the building. I didn't know the place very well. Eventually, I saw a kid, which turns out to be her son. Um, we got out of the building. Uh, I looked up again. She was still on the top floor. So me and Andre, we ran back in. We looked at each other, we ran back in. Around between the second and third story, there was a man in a wheelchair with his wife, and he couldn't get out. He was stuck on the stairs. And we brought him right down, right to the front of the building, right here, and we helped him push him to the uh, bus stop. And then that's when we went in for the third time to try to get to the woman and her son. But we got right to the foot of the door, and we had to leave because the, uh, the fumes were too strong.